Hello everybody out there and welcome back here once again with the future and this time for everybody I have a special WWE Tops Then Now and Forever 2016 trading cards unboxing. This is a set that I picked up from Walmart for $20 and change and it says it's only at Walmart so a Walmart exclusive um, box. Um, 10 packs plus one relic and one exclusive Brock Lesnar trading card inside. Um, you can see there ages six plus for the trading cards. This set has, you can see AJ Styles, Sasha Banks, John Cena, The Rock featured on there, and two sides has Brock Lesnar on it. I love that side, that picture of Brock. I will not get rid of this box once I open it up here. But I'm going to unbox this for everybody. Um, just a little background on the set. It was released this fall. It expands on the earlier 2016 base cards. Um, it is a 100 base card set, including Legends and Superstars. The inserts are Rock Tribute cards, NXT Prospects, Total Divas, WWE Breaking Ground, Stone Cold Podcast cards, Memorabilia cards, Shirt Relic cards, Royal Rumble 2016 Matt cards, Commemorative Medallion cards, Mask and Face Paint Medallion cards, Kiss cards, and Autograph cards. So I'm hoping besides you know the one relic and exclusive that I get in here that these packs have some other inserts in here that I just named off um, so let's get into the opening this I have to remind everybody here before I get started that I may have to make this a two-part video I only have like 19 minutes to hold on my SD card so if that's the case I will stop at 19 minutes and um, upload part one and then I will do part two after it is uploaded um, off of my camera and uh, do part two and upload it as part two of the opening um, but maybe we can get it all here in one I don't know I'm not gonna try to rush through it so probably we'll take some time here going through ten packs um, but let me set the camera up here to where we're recording the other way so I can start opening this up I have my knife here to get this uh, packaging off so hopefully we can all see that on camera. Yeah, thinking we're getting that. Um, so very cool here. Wonder what uh, exclusive Brock Lesnar card I'm going to get here. So opening the contents, uh, I have a box insert here. It's been a while since I've gotten a box of cards, but here we pull them out. Um, as you can see here is the one uh, bonus relic card inside here we're gonna open that up last um, and then we have a bunch of packs um, I'm hoping I get my exclusive uh, Brock Lesnar relic or autograph card in here this one has the bonus relic card so um, I'm guessing maybe the uh, uh, Brock Lesnar is also inside of there too. Um, the front of the pack, you have Sting, Cena, and uh, The Rock there, as you can see. Very cool. Um, so let's open the first pack. Ten cards in a pack. Hope everybody can see me okay. If not, I'm sorry. I'm going to try to do this as good as I can. Come on, get some autographs. Well, we have uh, Jack Swagger there, just a regular card. Oh, right off the bat, I got a Brock Lesnar. The Beast got beat by uh, Goldberg just the other night on Survivor Series. I'm recording this on uh, Monday night, almost Sunday morning. Or, I mean, almost Tuesday morning, excuse me. Um, he was beat in a minute and 25 seconds. So, there's Brock. We got a Baron Corbin. Uh, Chief J. Strongbow. The legendary General Adnan. I'm hoping everybody can see these cards okay. Then we have, it looks like, a versus card here. Key matches, rivalries of uh, Dolph, Zib Dolph Ziggler in The Miz. Sorry there. Um, these two have had a epic feud here going on lately. Um, they had that career versus title match that was really good. Then you have a uh, NXT card here, D'Angelo Dawkins, who's still around in there. Um, so nothing real overwhelming. Got the Brock card. Let's open the second second pack here. Um, we have Joey Mercury. Oh yeah. Oh, you gotta love it. The legendary Norman Smiley. 
Oh, yeah. We have the Icon Sting. Pretty cool. Hopefully everybody's seeing that because I have my camera turned around here. We have the Mighty Yokozuna. So nothing too big yet. Um, Seth Rollins versus Biggie. A key matches. Um, I'm trying to remember when that was a really a key match, but we have a Rock tribute insert card here. It's uh, Rock retaining the championship at Elimination Chamber 2013. Um, when he defeated CM Punk in the rematch for the championship with Paul Heyman alongside him. Great one prevailed. And then uh, Peyton Royce from NXT. So, there's that pack. Billy Kay and Peyton Royce are a tag team right now in NXT. So, she's still going. Um, here we have the Funks. Looks like Dory Funk Jr. and Terry Funk there. Rosa Mendez, who hasn't been seen for, I think she's pregnant right now, actually. Oh, we got the doc, Luke Gallows. Oh, everybody's favorite, John Cena. So a bunch of just basic, really, so far. A legendary Larry Zabisco, the living legend. Ooh, this is a cool versus card right here. Brock versus The Undertaker. Hope everybody's seeing that all right. And uh, just to make sure, I'm going to check my time here. Sorry, everybody. So, we're going through pretty good here. There's the Brock. Um, we have the current NXT Women's Champion, Asuka. Gotta love that. So, we're down two packs already. And I did a lot of talking, so I'm trying to go through them pretty quick here. Might be able to get it in one take. Here we have uh, Darren Young. The phenomenal AJ Styles. We have Cowboy Bob Orton. Howard Finkel. The Fink himself. We have Pat Patterson. Oh, yeah. First Intercontinental Champion. We have another versus card. It's uh, Apollo Crews versus the Drifter, Elias Sampson. Wow. Apollo Crews saves Johnny Gargano from Elias Sampson on NXT and then defeats Elias Sampson in his short run in NXT. And then this is a cool NXT card. Hideo Itami has him fighting Tyler Breeze, who I haven't seen for a while. So... There's another pack down. Let's get to the next one. Waste no time here. Looks like I have Junkyard Dog. And speaking of dogs, I hope my dog don't start barking here, but if he does, I'm sorry. We have Sergeant Slaughter himself, the Sarge. Yeah, it looked like he was in his hill run there, too. We have uh, the late Viscera. Viscera to see a car to him. Roman Reigns. Have the other half of uh, Gallows and Anderson. We have Carl Anderson. Machine Gun from uh, NJPW. We have uh, Dean Ambrose, Seth Rollins, a versus card. It's pretty cool. And then the Perfect Ten, Ty Dillinger. Um, let's see now. About nine minutes in, so we got another ten minutes. Oh, sorry there for the uh, collapse. I think we might be able to get this all in. Perfect ten, Ty Dillinger there. Next we have the next pack. I'm down to five packs here. Hope everybody's enjoyed it so far. Haven't got nothing too exciting. We have Greg Hamilton. Some announcer. Uh, Dean Ambrose. Uh, once again, I hope everybody's seen these good. I'm not trying to hold them up too long because I do have limited time. Uh, Big E here. We have the newest member of the new Wyatt family, Randy Orton, the Viper. Um, also, we have Finn Balor versus Kevin Owens. Pretty cool one right there. NXT uh, defeats Finn Balor and then defeats Owens for the NXT Championship. I'm reading some stuff on the back. 
Gotta love the demon. I'm ready for him to come back. Another rock tribute card. We have uh, the rock in the travesty storyline when he helped. Uh, well, not a storyline, but a moment when he helped Roman Reigns um, fend off Big Show and Kane. Yeah, I remember that. Uh, where was that at? Royal Rumble 2015. I remember the crowd just crapped all over that one. Um, and then Sawyer Fulton of the new um, group they have there in uh, NXT um, called Sanity along with Eric Young. Next one we have, we got uh, 1043 in. I'm going to be able to get them all probably in this one take. Um, we have the Diamond Cutter Master himself, Master of the Diamond Cutter, DDP, Diamond Dallas Page. Responsible for helping a lot of guys in their career, Kevin Nash, Scott Hall, and more. We have uh, Jamie Noble, who just returned to WWE, the Night of Survivor Series, backstage. Mr. Wonderful, Paul Orndorff. Legend card. We have Mr. Y2J, Chris Jericho himself. Don't get put on the list. I hope I'm not on his list. But uh, I'm sure if I met him, I'd probably be put on it. We have none other than the Native American Tatanka. Oh, yeah. I remember he had a hell of a run. He was like kind of undefeated, and then it just dropped off. I know he, he's made some rumors about how he was supposed to defeat Michaels for the Intercontinental title and stuff. I don't remember, but I think it was something like that at WrestleMania, but it fell through. Um, we have uh, Cesaro Kevin Owens. And uh, this is just um, Blake from Blake and Murphy. Um, his name's Wesley Blake, but they're just calling him Blake here. Um, here's the next pack. So I'm hoping to get these three packs done here in the time remaining. Check the time here in a second. I have um, Emma, who's soon to be coming back as Emmalina anytime. I don't think I've seen a preview of her tonight, but maybe it's SmackDown that's Emmalina's on. Yeah. Uh, Dean Malenko. Got an old school shot here of uh, Jim the Anvil Nyar. It looked like pre uh, or very beginning of the Hart Foundation days. And that's funny because uh, the manager of the Hart Foundation originally, Jimmy Hart, is next. Then you have one member of the New Day, Xavier Woods. You have Austin Aries against No Way Jose. I remember they fought at a uh, takeover. It was NXT TakeOver Back to Brooklyn. That was a good match. Um, I remember the dancing that Austin Aries did, and then he fooled him. And then one of my favorites going right now that I have, and it's his first NXT card. Very happy to have it. Shinsuke Nakamura, um, the King of Strong Style. This is a very, very cool card. And uh, right now we have uh, 13, 17 remaining. So Shinsuke Nakamura, very cool card. Hopefully, I'm getting these in the shot. I'm naming them off if not. But yeah, we have plenty of time to get through this. I have uh, the King Harley Race, or Handsome Harley Race, whatever you want to call him, until he got turned into the King. Uh, we have The Undertaker. Very cool. Just a regular Undertaker. Um, Latino Heat himself, Eddie Guerrero, the late Eddie Guerrero. Very cool. One member of the VOD Villains, Aiden English. Member of the Wyatt family, Eric Rowan. Um, but he is injured right now. I'm expecting him to come back and join Harper and Orton when he does, hopefully soon. Um, this one here is Baron Corbin... And Dolph Ziggler, another versus card. And then Elias Sampson, the Drifter from NXT. And I'm down to one pack in the special insert pack. It looks like that might be all I'm going to get. Unless I get a special one in this pack. Let's hope I do. Get something special here. Um, we have Luke Harper, the other member of the Wyatt family. Shane McMahon, who took one hell of an RKO at Survivor Series, but... He's alright. Just a hell of a concussion, I'm sure. You have the self-proclaimed giant Big John Stud. 
He was a giant, though, but I remember him always claiming he was the real giant in that feud with Andre. You have the High Chief Peter Maivia, the grandfather of The Rock. Tom Phillips. Wow. Uh, Tyler Breeze. Uh, Neville, a versus card. Kind of cool. And then uh, No Way Jose himself. I think he's kind of comical. Um, good wrestler, too. Um, 15 minutes left here, uh, or 15 minutes in, so we have plenty of time to uh, reveal the last, um, pack here, which is the insert cards, which is all I'm worried about, so hopefully I get my 20 worth here. So, let's see here. Oh, boy. I'm already kind of laughing, but, uh, the Brock card that I have is none other than... Him facing Roman Reigns and Seth Rollins at WrestleMania 31 when Rollins cashed in. So it's a pretty cool card. You can see the back here too. And I should have showed off some of the backs of these two, but trying to get through it fast. There's the Brock Lesnar card. And the Relic card that I got, it's actually a rookie card, so hopefully he goes on to do something. But it's authentic... Uh, Shirt relic of Simon Gotch. You can tell it's one of them great uh, brownish vaude villain shirts. It says, Congratulations. You now own an authentic shirt relic card from 2016 Tops WWE Now and Then Forever. Then, now, forever. Sorry. But, uh, yeah, everybody. Um, hopefully, everybody enjoyed this video of this unboxing, and that's it. Um, 16 minutes it took me, so it took me a lot shorter than what I thought. It didn't take me no two parts, so that's cool. Um, I hope everybody liked it. Um, I'm kind of disappointed, but for 20-some bucks, hopefully, you know, at least I got a rookie card relic, Simon Gotch. This Brock card's cool, too. And I got the rookie card of Shinsuke Nakamura um, and some Brock cards and everybody else that I got in here that I named off that I was satisfied with, like Sting. Um, some of them versus cards are cool with Finn Balor. But yeah, um, I guess uh, go to Walmart and give it a try. Maybe you'll have better luck than I did. But I want to thank everybody for tuning into this unboxing. Hopefully the video turned out well. And uh, I want to thank everybody as always for tuning in and uh, checking me out. If you haven't subscribed, make sure you do. Uh, leave a comment down below if you're into what I'm doing here or if you just like my vids, period. Um, and make sure to drop me a like if you like what you saw. Um, if this is your first time viewing, do all that too. And uh, I appreciate the support. And as always, guys, you got to love it. You got to love the WWE trading cards on the Night of Survivor Series getting this done. And as always, till next time, guys, peace out.